Okay guys, I am back with a flip through of this little pretty thing. And I just wanted to show you guys, I did, a, did go ahead and put the number one um, in here and not glue it in because I was like, well, maybe somebody might want to do an inter introduction, that sort of thing. And I have decided to list this. So by the time you see this video, it should be listed. Um, I'll probably list it like late Saturday night because I actually think I was wrong on days on um, when videos would be airing. Um, yeah, it happens. Okay. So this journal measures eight and a half by five and three quarters. Um, and it's an in about an inch and a half thick at its spine. Um, this is a snippet that I made. And then of course we painted the cover together. And then this part is um, from Susan Taylor Brown's kit named Christmas with Dee Dee. And just a quick reminder that there is a coupon code and it didn't, it doesn't just work for the kit here it's like your total purchase so if you go to Susan's shop and you find a couple more kits um then um it, it works like on your total purchase so yeah go check that out um and so yeah let's get started um so this is some of the fabric <clears throat> that we stamped a couple weeks ago um with it's a wonderful life and I just thought it it added a little bit more to it I thought it was cute and so yeah, let's get started. Um, I don't remember how many pages I ended up putting in this thing. So, okay, so I have left the front of these pockets blank. The reason being is when I originally was making it, maybe for me, I thought it'd be really cute to put pictures here. And there's not, there's not any coffee dyeing in, or tea dyeing in this journal. And the reason being is so that if you do put in like Christmas photos or whatever, it doesn't mess with them. So it's, um, that's why I originally left these blank. Um, but these can easily be journaled on with a little bit of blue or black ink. Okay. So if you'll remember back, um, we made these pockets and I just, um, these tags come in the kit as well and they're all backed with that parchment paper. Okay. And then it flips out here and here's one of the little tags or um, ephemera pieces, I guess I should say, that come in the kit here. So that is in this one. And then um, here is another tag that we made together. Well, no, I'm sorry, that tag come, okay, so the pocket we made together, the tag comes in the kit, oh my goodness. And then here's just one of the smaller journaling cards here. Okay, little pocket there, and then it flips closed. And then that slides over to cover that. So let's count the pages really quick. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, sixteen. So sixteen pages. So, um, how that's usually figured um for those of you that are new this took me forever to kind of fill like figure out so 16 times 4 so that's 64 pages total so because you take the front the front the back and then the other half front and back and that's that's basically how they figure out how many pages it is and check out how beautiful that eco die is of Susan's kit. Okay, this little pocket that we made, to, this is the little pocket we made together. And I've just um, put one of the little journaling cards in here. And then um, I just backed this with the parchment card stock. Okay, some more of that eco paper here. And this is the parchment paper, and um, I know I've had a few questions on it. I get it at Home Depot, or Office Depot, and it's 24 pound. And this stuff prints well, too. Okay, here's some more of the kit paper here. Some lined paper there. And then this, these right here where the pockets are, those are cardstock. Okay, and then there's just a little Hermelinda flip up here. Right, isn't that? I think it's Hermelinda. Okay, and then um, I just add a little bit of scalloping edges to that card there. Okay, some more kit paper here. Looks like I 
got a little crazy with the trimmer, so I'm just going to trim that little piece off here. Yeah, some of them did that. Hmm. Okay, so then um, here's some more of the kit paper there. And then here's the pocket we made together with the Let It Snow, right? We, did we make that together? No, I think I made this one off. Or did I? Honestly, guys, I can't remember now. So it's just a little pocket here. And here's some of the cute little pieces of, um, or little um, ephemera journaling cards. Goodness gracious. It's like I didn't get enough sleep or something last night, which I did. <laughs> Maybe too much, I guess. And then on this side right here is a journaling card here with some more of the cute gnomes from the kit. And it just slides right in there. I promise it does. Right there. Okay. Some more of that gorgeous kit paper there. Another piece of cardstock. And this pocket was made with the, um, I printed it printed the kit on cardstock and then um, made this little pocket here and this little saying comes in the kit and then we have another scalloped edge card there it just slides right down in there some more of that beautiful kit paper And then this pocket we made together yesterday, I believe. And then I just put on the inside some of that cardstock to um, firm that up there a little bit. And that cute little card with the little goat. Okay, some more of the kit papers. Okay, and then we have this um, little pocket here. This little piece comes in the kit. And a little gnome there. And then this pocket here, I just used my little, actually it's a tuck. Um, I just used my little tree punch and then backed it with the kit paper here. I did a little stenciling on that. And then I um, ticket punched that little card there. Okay. Some more of that beautiful kit paper. And then here's that little pocket we made together on Friday, I think it was. It just opens up, flips down, and then I've just put little tiny tags in there for that. It flips back up and I've glued it on kind of like a little belly band here um, and put one of the uh, kit tags in there. So it just slides right down in there like that. Okay. Okay, and then the back side here is another little flip with the little triangle pockets there. And um, these little cards all come in the kit. And I think they're just adorable. And then we have a little tag from the kit here. And then one here. And then a couple more of the little cards that come in the kit here. This is so stinking cute. Oh my goodness. I am so in love with this kit. You will definitely be seeing more of these in the upcoming weeks as we start decorating and making more Christmas stuff. All right. So that does it for the flip through for this little journal. And thank you for coming along with me. I absolutely adore this little journal. Um, I think it's one of the cutest ones I've ever made. I really like it. Um, and again, it comes with the numbers and then it will also come with the extra, um, the last bits that are, uh, from the oh, snippet roll. Sorry. Or is that what they're called? Snippets anyways. Um, so yeah, you'll get those in in with it and like I said that'll be listed on Sunday 
probably late, 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 late Saturday night. Okay, guys. Um, thank you for joining me on this journey. Again, there's 20% off on um, in her shop with this code. So we will talk to you soon. Bye, guys.